Hello and welcome back to Vampire Survivors. I'm actually playing the new DLC and it actually came out a number of weeks ago and I'm just getting around to playing it now. I've played a huge amount of Vampire Survivors. I think according to Steam, I played over 60 hours of it actually. Yeah, uh, some of that might actually be, you know, me just leaving it on, idling and so on and so forth. But yeah, anyway, I don't even have some of these levels unlocked, unfortunately. But yeah, I have a bunch of special areas as well here. As you can see, Mount Moonspell. I have no idea what that's all about. So I'm thinking maybe we should give it a go. Shall we give it a go? I'm actually using the hurry mode as well. So this is actually going to be kind of interesting as it is. We have a bunch of Arcanas here. I haven't unlocked all of them, as you might expect. I... Again, I'm uh, not, you know, I'm, I'm just literally, I, I stopped playing a while ago and, uh, well, the new DLC came out. Might as well try it, right? Okay, so we're going to be going for Iron Blue Will first because this is just absolutely incredible. If you want to go for something that is just going to murder everything, we're going to go for something like that. And then we're just going to try and see what we can do here. So obviously, I'm currently playing with the uh the, the uh like double shooty guns basically yeah the double shooty guns that's what they're called right yeah <laughs> oh i'm gonna be oh yeah this is gonna be great because I, I don't actually remember basically anything about the game so i do apologize already but uh yeah we're just gonna try and level this up as best we can the whip is actually really good as well so maybe i actually go for the whip too yeah i'll go for the whip as well because uh, you know, being able to regenerate your HP later on down the line when you actually evolve it, that's going to be really useful. Uh, should we go for braces? Yeah, we'll go for braces because that's really good for evolving the dagger. Uh, the knife, I actually really like evolving that because it just generally makes things so much easier for you. And we're also going to be going for the relic on this level as well. I think that that's probably going to be a good idea if I can actually make it there. Can I actually make it there actually? Because uh, as you can see, uh, it's a bit difficult bit difficult for me to do that right now but it should be absolutely fine as you can see the, the I, I really like this character actually this is one of my favorite characters to play as this is uh pugnala pugnala or something like that i'm not entirely sure how to say her name but whatever the case uh we're gonna go for more projectiles more projectiles please thank you very much and uh yeah we're gonna try and go for that relic that is currently on the screen i don't even know whether that is a relic what is what is that over here though this is like a a sword of some kind? I have no idea. Oh, this is this thing. It's going to give me, um, ma you know, magnetized um, magnetized uh, experience coming towards me for the moment. I can't even get by here. Okay, that's weird. All right. Can't even get by here. So I guess we're going to have to go around the other way. Okay, that's going to be interesting. We should go for maybe the candelabra. The duplicator is going to be really, really useful too. But I'm going to go for... Um, eight sparrow, just upgrade that a little bit more too. Seems like this this level is really interesting actually. I have, as I say, I've not actually done this level ever before, so this is going to be real, real interesting to see if I can actually do it. Because let's face it, I'm I'm okay at the game. All right, I'm okay at the game. I'm not uh, I'm not amazing. I'm not uh, one of the best in the world or anything like that. But I am definitely you know solid, and I do I do kind of understand how to play it you know from a basic understand you know basic understanding of it but you know with the new dlc oh here we go tiramisu yep i well tiragisu as as they call it here we're going to be taking that so that we can evolve our wonderful pistols as fast as possible so that they only take up one space as far as i'm aware in comparison to the taking up two so then we can take an additional weapon and then we'll be able to uh, upgrade other things in the future, hopefully. Or we could just take an additional weapon um, anyway. And it doesn't really matter too much about that. Anyway, I'm just going to try and level up here real fast. Okay, we're going to... Um, yeah, I'm not really looking for that. Thank you very much. Just going to try and take some, some other things here. And basically what I want to try to do is I want to try to get my pistols to the max level that they can be as fast as possible without having to kill any of the elite enemies because if you kill the elite enemies early on they drop their chest and then well if you're on this level which is what i am currently playing on if you're on this level it's gonna be pretty difficult to get back to that chest obviously if you're playing on a regular level then you're probably not going to have too many difficulties it's probably going to be a bit easy for you to get back to that chest but as it stands right now, I'm having some big problems actually reaching it, as you can see, because they're just able to completely 
surround me and it's very very difficult for us to get to that place hello what is this a cursed weapon oh dear this is bad <laughs> i should not have gone for that okay let's just revive i have tirigasu after all so okay i have a cursed weapon now i have no idea what it actually does what is it actually doing is it actually doing anything for me right now I, I have no... Oh, no! There's Okay, that thing wants to kill me. Okay, hello. Oh, oh, ho okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bad things are afoot. Bad things are afoot. Please do not kill me. You absolute skeleton. That is that is exactly what he is. He is an absolute skeleton right there. Okay, let me just try and avoid all of these guys. Thank you very much. Oh, my. Yeah, he's just appearing all over the place now. Please give me some chicken. Can you give me some chicken or some turkey or whatever? Okay, yeah, we're going to get attacked by these things now as well. Oh, wonderful. Oh, wonderful. Look at this. Okay. Hmm, this is great. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Maybe I can go this way? Oh, of course not. No. Can't go that way. Okay, so I have a cursed sword, as you can quite clearly tell. And the cursed sword is really not doing me any favors. Okay, yeah, that was... Well, I found it. <laughs> I found it. I mean, that's, that's kind of okay, right? Yeah. Ugh. Okay, yeah, that didn't really go very well, did it? No, that didn't go very well. Okay, well, wh what about, um, let me see, what else can we go for here? We could go for Popea. Popea is actually a really, really good character, so why not? Let's let's try and play with her. We've done a little bit of a, a look at the Mount Moon spell thing. I'm probably not going to do that one this time. I have already completed the Bone Zone once, um, but that was a long time ago. We could do Moon Glow. Moon Glow? What, 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 what? I don't even know what this is. I guess we'll try to do that and we'll see how it goes. Arcana. Okay, uh, we want something really, really fun for this. Okay, uh, what do we want? Whoa, okay. Uh, these are all fantastic, actually. Slash might be really fun. Yeah, let's go for Slash. Let's go for that. Okay, I don't, I don't know who this, th who, who's this guy? Who's this guy right here? Who is that? Fancy a new wizard? What? <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, they allow me to change my starting weapon. Okay, that's actually really interesting. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to be doing that. I, I appreciate it. I'm not going to be doing it, though, because there's no point. My current weapon as Popea is absolutely amazing, something that I really, really love. Also going to be using... Oh, wow. Okay, there's a lot of really cool stuff here. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, I think I will get this. Cooldown reduction? Yeah, that's really good, actually. We should probably go for this, too. And this. And then we'll just build from there, and we'll just try to get um, try to get the items that are associated with those. Um, I need to get the duration increase one, don't I? Uh, so yeah, let's get magic wand because that's obviously associated with the um, the tome that I have already. So that's really good. And what what do we need now? We need. Uh, this is good, I guess. Yeah, this is okay. And then we need this for the dagger. And that's for the fire wand. And the other thing is for the axe thing, which I don't really care about that much. Okay. Hmm. Right. Okay. I'm just kind of getting a bit more used to this whole thing again, because it's it's been a while. I think I need to get cursed, don't I? Don't I need to get Curse? I think so. Yes. There we go. Yeah, so that's what we're going to do. And uh, the Clover is not useful. Um, I mean, actually, I can pick up all of these now because I have all of them. I, I'm actually, probably shouldn't do that. Hmm. I mean, technically, I could. But the problem is, I don't want to inspire the game to give me the poor choices if you know what i mean i want to get the other things as much as possible i want to get the other options all, all, all the time instead of having um, the chance of getting the other things so yeah we're just gonna leave these things on the map i don't think they're gonna disappear but if they do disappear then well that, that's just how it's gonna have to be but 
I think the way that I'm going to do it now is a little bit smarter, potentially. We'll see what happens, though. Maybe it's not going to be that smart. Anyway, we're going to go for the King Bible, as you can see right there. We're going to go for one of those. There we go. That's always a nice one. Don't know if I'm even going to need it, to be honest. Let's just take this straight away, as I was talking about before. Generally, it may not be the best idea to take the chest straight away, because the chest can actually give you evolutions and... I usually like to save the chests as much as possible, but because it's going to take me a while to actually get to the evolutionary forms, I think it's probably best just to take it and just get the upgrade straight away. That's that's pretty much what I'm thinking right now. So that's the reason why I'm going for that. Uh, also, uh, we'll go for knife. Yeah, we'll go for knife. What else do I need actually right now? I need the lightning ring and I need the... Um, Santa water or whatever it is, right? Yeah, I think I need the Santa water. Or what? what, what is that thing called? I can't remember what it's called now. Uh, yeah, but there's the lightning ring. Fantastic. Yeah, we're going to take that. Thank you. That's absolutely perfect. And uh, we're, we're actually doing pretty nicely so far in, in regards to our... Um, uh, you know, our, our, our various array of things that we can do because when I get my dagger fully maxed out the dagger is going to be insanely strong it's going to be really really strong for killing bosses and then everything else is going to be killing well everything else <laughs> you know all of my other equipment is just going to be doing so much damage to everything in an AoE it's going to be really really good okay unfortunately this is not what we want but I guess I'm just going to take the skull maniac right here um, okay, so what else do I need? I need the, the Santa water. Yeah, I need the Santa water. So I'm looking for that. Hopefully we're going to be able to get it. I can always re-roll, by the way. I can re-roll if I want to. So that might be something that we want to go for. But this time around, I won't because Song of Mana is amazing. And I want to try and upgrade that as, as fast as I possibly can. Let's just pick this up. Oh, wonderful. We got an epic chest. Okay, that's going to be great. That basically gives us huge amounts of upgrades. I'm hopeful for Song of Mana all across the board here. That would be amazing. No, we didn't get it at all, unfortunately. But we did get a Lightning Ring upgrade, which is actually kind of nice, and a Magic Wand upgrade too. So I guess that's fine. And there's another Song of Mana here. Gonna be taking that. It just does so much damage, it really does. It is one of the best weapons in the game, in my opinion. Um, and you're gonna be able to just do absolute craziness with it really okay there we go oh we got this ah no ah, yeah i don't know why they're not giving me that but we are getting some good upgrades nevertheless i'm just wondering when we're actually going to get to a point where they're going to give me something that i just cannot take and then i'm going to have to re-roll it or whatever but um yeah lightning ring technically you can take the freezing gun if you want to kill death at the end obviously if you want to kill death then that's pretty much the only way you can do it as far as i'm aware um, but obviously maybe the strategies have changed in that time because obviously it's been a while since I've played so I, I don't know but maybe it is anyway fire wand I mean not fire wand magic wand upgrade it's going to be good for me and they're chucking a bunch of really powerful enemies at me right now but it's actually seemingly not going too well for them which is good let's go for some more magic wand stuff good amounts of experience here I'd like to pick up the experience gain uh, booster if at all possible but I'm obviously not able to do that right now. Can you please give me the thing that I need? Can you please give me the uh, the Santa water thing? That would be amazing, please. That would be wonderful. But uh, apparently they don't want to give me that for some reason. Don't know why. No, no. So, okay, here we go. I'm going to have to re-roll this. Okay, this is not what I want, but I will take a lightning ring. Yeah, hmm. Getting a bit unlucky there. A bit unlucky, but... Can't do much about it. I'm just going to try and farm as much experience as possible. Yeah, we're also getting unlucky here too, once again. Going to have to re-roll this. I could take the Attract Orb, but I just want to re-roll it because I want to try and see if I can actually get what I want. Ah, uh, we're getting unlucky here. Okay, Lightning Ring, I guess, is good enough. But yeah, the, the water is what I want. The Santa water thing. You know, the thing that uh, comes down from the from the sky and just absolutely murders everything. Uh, unfortunately, we're not getting it. Go for the duplicator, I guess. Okay, whoa, they're coming at me with a bunch of enemies right now. 
yeah, technically I should probably just pick up all this stuff, to be honest now. Should probably just pick up all the, uh, all the passives, you know, just pick them all up because it seems to me like I'm not getting very lucky. So, yeah, there's the set into water, fantastic. Okay, never mind, we did get lucky. Excellent. All right, so now I can basically pick up everything. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to pick up absolutely every single thing that we can. And we're just going to try and level up as fast as possible now and try to get my Song of Mana uh, level to 8. And then we should be able to evolve it because there is a chest on the floor there and that should theoretically give me the evolution straight away. Obviously, that is very much a case of me just crossing my fingers and hoping that they haven't changed it. But it used to be that you could save chests, so to speak. You could save chests and then you could actually um, use them once you've gotten level 8 in a certain thing. So hopefully that's going to be the same here, but who knows. I, I actually don't know about that, but yeah, well, I guess we'll find out. Yes, give me all the experience. Aha, we got this too, which is a nice little fire breath here. It's going to do massive damage. Song of Mana once again. Let me just try and kill this big thing with the uh, wonderful fire breath. There we go. Ah, oh, we're getting unlucky here. Okay, I'm going to reroll. Oh, you. Okay, fine, fine. Lightning Ring, I guess we'll go for. Kind of wanted to get the Song of Mana to level 8, but unfortunately not getting lucky here. Okay, let's just try and destroy this thing. Uh, okay, I'm going to reroll. Yes, we got it. All right, we got it. Fantastic. Let's just... It. Oh, okay, we get another one of these. All right, so yeah, this is what we want to go for. We want to go for something like... Not this. Not this. Not that. Okay, so we will be taking the Waltz of Pearls. There we go, and then we are good, and we're going to just start increasing our knife here a bunch more. I'm actually dying really, really fast right now, which is actually making me kind of sad, but uh, hopefully I can get some... Yeah, there we go. We actually healed ourselves. Wonderful. Okay, where's the chest? The chest is down here, so I'm actually going to go straight down there very quickly, and I'm just going to open it up. Hopefully this is going to be the evolution like I think it's going to be. Yes, it is. Wonderful. So it actually still works the same way. And as you can see, oh, we're just going to... We're cooking with gas now. We are cooking with gas now. Oh, yes, we are. All right. So let's just upgrade the magic wand. Just let's be very careful here. Okay, I'm, I shouldn't have actually picked this up. I shouldn't have actually picked this up right now, but I'm an idiot, so I did. Oh, well, never mind. That's fine. It's fine. It's not too bad. Although it is kind of bad. Shouldn't have done that, but... Oh, well, never mind. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, there's actually another chest up here, um, but I need to get another level up. There we go. Uh, my knife is actually almost at level 8. Okay. Hello. That's a lot of eyeballs. I'm not looking forward to uh, getting murdered by this. Okay. My, uh, my damage is actually really good right now, so I'm kind of happy about this. I'm happy I took Slash, to be honest. Because it, uh, with the knife upgrade, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. If I get my knife to level 8. Oh, hello. Everything is dropping. What is this? This is, this is psychedelic. Oh, wow. Okay, what actually happened? Okay. Um. What? Um, this is... Okay, this is completely new to me. This is completely new to me. I have no idea what is going on here. Okay. Uh, I have no idea. I was actually very much enjoying myself, and now I'm just like, oh my, what, what is this? What, what is this? I have no clue. Okay, can, can I actually destroy this thing with the fire breath? I don't think I can, right? No way. Okay, I'm just going to continue moving through here, because apparently they want me to move through here. Okay, yes, give me the healing, please. Yes, give me the healing. I am obviously very much weakened in comparison to what I was before. I have basically no things, no, uh, no items at all. All I have is my basic default item, which is very sad. But I am healing myself, which is good. 
Okay, uh, the eyeballs are coming back now, so I'm going to assume that I am going to probably be teleported back. Oh, huge amounts of deaths, apparently, as well. Hello. Okay, I made it. I made it to the end. Hello, death. Um, can I, I can just walk out here. Yeah, there we go. This, this is so psychedelic. This is so incredibly psychedelic. Okay, so I found... What is this? Permanently allows the detection of hidden items in all stages. <laughs> that is hilarious. Okay, a wonderful clapping right there being done. Okay, that is that is very nice. Okay, oh, 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 okay. And now, as you can see, everything is backwards. Wait a minute, is it backwards? Let me see if I can turn my head. No, I have no idea what that says. I have no idea what that says. Okay. Right. Um, so that was the end? Yeah, that was the end of that. That was actually the end of that level, hilariously enough. I had no idea that that was actually the end. I thought to myself, am I, am I doing it right? No, yeah, yes, no, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. All right, so apparently I did that, although it doesn't say that I've done it. Which is amusing. Because as you can see, it says that I haven't done it. This is the one that I was in. Uh, okay. I have no idea. I actually have no idea. But I, uh, I think that's probably a good place to uh, end the episode. So uh, yeah. <laughs> Let me know if you want to see more from me and Vampire Survivors. I, as I say, I absolutely love this game. Oh, you know, I mean, so many people do, of course. And uh, the DLC did just come out a couple of weeks ago, if you didn't know. Uh, but it adds, uh, I think, eight new classes to unlock. I think eight new classes, bunch of new levels, uh, new arcanas, new weapons. It basically adds a huge array of different things. And you can check it out. Um, you can go to the Steam Store page, obviously, link in the description and everything. Otherwise, I thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.